Ahmad. Hazar Kubaruch, Bezrat Hashem in Ha is going to be 525. Please be on time. What happens in a case which is, seems to be a very rare and extreme circumstance, but a person who is a Hazan forgets to say Kiddusha. Somehow, him and the whole congregation completely forgot to say Kiddusha. As we know, Kiddusha is supposed to be said after the Bracha Mehaya Metim. And before you say Ata Kadosh, Vishimcha Kadosh. So he already started Ata Kadosh, Shimcha Kadosh. And they didn't say Kiddusha, they didn't say Naktishach ben Aritzach. So the Alakha says, if he remembers before he set, finishes Baruch Ata Hashem Ha'el HaKadosh, so then obviously you go back to after Mechayim Metim, you go back to the end of that Bracha, and you say Kiddusha, and then you're able to finish the Bracha of Ata Kadosh. But what happens if you already finished Ata Kadosh, and you only remembered at that point before he started Ata Honen? So the Alakha says you can say it right then and there. If you did not start at Honen yet, then you're allowed to say Kiddusha right in that spot and it's not, you don't, you're not going back. You're saying it there and then you continue in the Tefillah. However, once you started at Honen, you already began that. Now you've already messed up. You have to go back to the beginning of the Shemona Isla. The entire Shemona Isla has to be started over again. Baruch Atah Hashem. And begin Hashem's Fatay Tiftach, the whole beginning, and do it over again. Because that, that already, at that point, you didn't make it up, and it's not good enough to go back to the third bracha. As we've already mentioned, that all three berachot are viewed as one. Baruch Adonai Le'olam.